Hey, there it is. Hey everyone, I am on the road today, and uh, I know I just got off the road, but uh, I'm back on. And today, my trip took me to Temple, Texas, which is south of Waco and north of Austin. It was an interesting and beautiful drive. I'm, there's a lot of, a lot of roads, a lot of trees, a lot of cows. But uh, as I was driving along, there was uh, several places that have abandoned equipment, abandoned old cars. And when I see stuff like that, I just think of all the opportunities for like making money and for, you know, a chance for somebody. And uh, there's another one. Look at, they got some really nice stuff in their backyard and it's just kind of loitering, just sitting there. And uh, same with that one. Look at the old cars. Oh my God. Underneath the lean-to, there's a whole bunch of old cars at that place. Like 1950s cars underneath the lean-to. And it's just sitting there. Just wasted opportunities. But anyway, that's why I wanted to talk to you guys uh, today about is opportunities. So when I was up in Temple, I was at the Baylor Scott Hospital and uh, I had the opportunity to, to stop by and work on some equipment there. And I really don't get to work on equipment very much anymore, but uh, today I did. And at the same time, I got to meet some really cool people. And it just kind of reminded me of why I love this job. I absolutely love this job, guys. Uh, I love all aspects of it. So now I normally am kind of a suit. I normally have to, you know, go to meetings and talk to people and stuff like that. But every once in a while, I get to get out there and work on some stuff hand in hand uh, with some of my fellow biomeds. And I really love those days. So today is one of those days. But uh, anyway, I wanted to uh, talk to you guys about opportunities because uh, I met one young fellow who is uh, who's currently an intern and was, you know it was just fortuitous that he's finishing up his internship and I might be looking for a position very soon in this region so it all kind of worked out you know and it's funny how these things happen and then uh, you know I do my normal talk with people I ask them if they're on LinkedIn and stuff because this is how you find jobs networking knowing people and if you don't know people, then somebody you know knows people. And that's the opportunities I wanted to talk to you guys about. There's opportunities absolutely everywhere. Everywhere. They're all around me. And, and when I get on these drives and I, I see all these opportunities to like advance, to make money, you know, to, to fix things, which is what I like doing, obviously. Um, I, I just think back on... Uh, you know, how I got started in this career field. And guys, I'm going to tell you for a fact, I will never, never close the door on a possible opportunity. This doesn't happen. Now, I've had to turn down some, some pretty interesting uh, job offers, even recently. And uh, it's only because I'm on a journey right now and I'm really curious where it's going to go. Uh, other than that, I, I will at least sit down and talk with them, maybe help them on their journey, because if they're looking for somebody to fill a position, then maybe I can help them, you know, find a candidate or something. If it's not me, maybe I can find somebody for them. But uh, I just want to let you guys know that opportunities come up all the time. One of them was like today, and this intern uh, was talking with me for a little bit, and had they not told me his situation with being an intern, I wouldn't have ever known and I never I wouldn't have asked obviously but that was an opportunity and somebody spoke up and because of that we might be able to get this fellow a job and I would be honored to have him on my team so uh, that's just it opportunities are everywhere there guys and even if you have a job that you like and you want to move forward in your career put feelers out there yeah, even if I have an excellent job, people come up to me all the time and they want to talk about, hey, I'd like to talk to you about, you know, this position or would you be interested in this or that? I'll talk to them regardless. 
I talk to him partially because I love the business of what we do, but I also talk to him because maybe I can help them out with something if I'm not the right candidate, which, I mean, there's a very good chance I'm not, so. But uh, I just wanna remind you guys to never close those doors, okay? And if you ever meet somebody in this career field that, that might be able to help you get further down the road, reach out to them. Use LinkedIn. Connect to them. As soon as you meet somebody, you shake their hand. Be like, hi, I'm this person. I'm that person. Look them up on LinkedIn. Connect with them immediately. And, you know, every once in a while, I'll touch base with them. Um, there's one person that does this particularly. Uh, he reaches back to me every once in a while. His, his name's uh, Jose. And he's out there in uh, Oklahoma City. Or uh, Kansas City. Kansas City. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm driving here. Um, but anyway, every once in a while he calls me up and he's like, hey Justin, how you doing, man? And it's because of our business relationship that he's got my cell phone number and everything, but it's good to reach back and talk to people like that, you know? Uh, often it's just a little chit-chat of what's been going on lately, uh, sometimes what's going on in the career field. But, uh, you know, that's, that's an example of somebody that keeps the door open, right? So these opportunities are everywhere out there, guys. I encourage you guys to go to events like obviously the MD Expo and the Amy Conference coming up here in June, right here in San Antonio. Um, I'll be at you know all these events, and uh, all I'm saying is if you guys go to these events, have your resume updated and be prepared to shake some hands. And as soon as you shake a hand, look them up on LinkedIn. As soon as you get their business card, connect to them on LinkedIn immediately, and uh, keep that door open. And opportunities are absolutely everywhere, guys. It's every single day that I'm out there uh, meeting new biomeds and stuff, I learn of new opportunities and new possibilities. And one of the things I can say, uh, especially including the crew that I met today, is I always like talking to younger people and I, I love seeing the spark of curiosity in their eye. I just love it. You know, I, I like watching people discover something new and uh, Biomed is one of those career fields where if you're a senior level biomed, you know, just sit back and watch the junior biomeds and, and you'll see something amazing. It really is. But anyway, guys, I'm traveling back towards Houston. It's going to be a long day today and then it's going to be a long day tomorrow. I'm heading down towards Victoria. That's going to be a, a good day as well. So <laughs> I'm on the road this week. Anyway, you guys have a wonderful day.